it's awesome. So what we're going to do now is uh, really simple. We're going to go and find also the link, as you can see right here, it's this one. So I'm just going to go and I'm just going to go and type in Facebook. Guys, my name is Alex. Welcome back to a brand new Vegas 14 tutorial. It is Wednesday, it means a new video for you guys. And in this video, I'm going to talk about a topic that is requested so many times. So as you probably guys can see, I think it's right here or right here. As you can see, I think it's right here. I'm going to show you guys how to make the social media lower third that you guys have all been requesting. So first of all, people say, how do you make that social media thing? Well, basically what I what this effect is called a lower third. It can be anything. It can, it can be a bar. Uh, that is going to be like across the entire screen it can be something little uh, I like i have in the corner about social media so this is just basically a social media lower third now the awesome the awesome the the awesome thing is that you guys don't need to go ahead and animate everything that you that you guys are seeing because what I did is I just created a temp well I just found a template rather and I just got that one which is completely customizable you can add in Google Plus uh, I replaced Google Plus with Twitch. Uh, so you gotta replace a few things if you're not using Google Plus like I am. So I'm gonna show you guys how to do all of that in this video. So make sure to smash the like button down below already and I would say let's get started. So what I did is I just put everything you need, including the Vegas file, into a folder and that folder is downloadable and you can find the link in the description. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up that folder as you guys can see. Uh, this one as you can see right now we have only Facebook uh, Instagram Twitter and Google Plus But let's say that you want to go ahead and start replacing Google Plus with Twitch or anything like that I'm gonna show you guys that in just a second. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just gonna call uh, I'm just gonna open up this project as you can see and right now it is opening up the project and I'm gonna show you guys how to customize this like to your own wants and needs. So as you can see right now, we will uh, end up with a green screen that has basically a green screen, uh, like a chroma key. You can remove that really easily. What you want to do is you wanna to go to video effects so you guys know you will remove the green so it's transparent so you can see yourself instead of the green. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over to the chroma key and we're gonna pick the, the green screen. We're gonna drag it on top of the green screen track and boom, it turns black. That means that it's transparent and you you will see the social media on top of your video. So now that we're gonna um, start re like replacing a few things here. So as you can see right now, it says facebook.com and then just, I think it's 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 uh, the owner of this uh, template or just the guide who created it. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start uh, making those tracks a little bit bigger so it's a little bit easier to see. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over and find the text files. So as you can see right now, I would like to uh, have Facebook with a capital letter, Facebook, and I would just rather have it, I would say, right here. That looks awesome. So what we're gonna do now is uh, really simple. We're gonna go and find also the link, as you can see right here, it's this one. So I'm just gonna go and I'm just gonna go and type in facebook.com forward slash just Alex. Halford, that's my Facebook page. As you can see, it is, it is fitting right. I think it is a little bit too big, make it a little bit smaller. As you can see, it says facebook.com forward slash just Alex Halford, boom. Now that we have this Facebook one, as you can see, the animation is all there for you. So you don't need to do anything. It is all filled in and all, you know, uh, pre-animated for you. Now, what you can do is the next one is Google Plus. Now, what we're gonna do, first of all, is we're gonna replace the Google Plus icon with the Twitch icon. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over to uh, Google and we're gonna look up a Twitch icon PNG. A few moments later, so I have that one on my desktop. So what we're gonna do, we're not gonna drag anything, we're not gonna remove anything, but we're gonna replace anything. So, well, this Google Plus icon. So we're gonna go to the project media, I'm gonna click on G Plus PNG, and I'm going to click on replace. And now we're gonna go to my desktop, and as you can see right here, I have a Twitch icon right here, boom. And as you can see, it doesn't really fit. So what we're gonna do then is we're gonna create a new video track, and I'm just going to make this smaller until it is fitting right on as you can see right there it's a little bit too big so let me just go ahead and place it exactly where it should be as you can see right now we have this and that is how awesome it looks so we have our facebook icon we have our twitch icon but twitch is a little bit too big let me adjust it a little bit though 3 28 a.m 
I would say this looks perfect. So as you can see, it says still Google Plus. What we're gonna do we're gonna, for the same as Facebook, we're gonna go to the text icon. And I'm just going to type in Twitch. And I'm also gonna place it at the beginning, as you can see right here. And then also to the bottom, we're gonna just, twinge, just tw uh, change this one to twitch.tv forward slash just Alex Halford. So now that we have our Twitch icon and our Twitch link in there, but as you can see, uh, it, is, it is still a red bar that we, we want we want that to turn purple so what we're gonna do we're gonna make this track a little bit bigger though as you can see really clear and now we're gonna go to the uh, the uh, like it is video media generator and we're gonna go to color and we're gonna change this one to purple until it suits with the icon so this is a little bit too pink this is a little bit too red let me go over to right here i think this looks perfect let me make it a little bit darker so as you can see boom we have our twitch icon right there it is really simple so now that we have our facebook we have our twitch we have our twitter right here so also it is the same thing i'm going to go a little bit faster now so we're going to go to uh, the text layer of the twitter one uh, place it right there, then go to the bottom, change the Twitter link, twitter.com forward slash Alex Halford, not just Alex Halford. And then at the end, we have Instagram. Go to there, let your AC OCD kick in <laughs> and change it to Instagram with a capital letter. Put it at the beginning of uh, the, the, the bar. Then at the bottom, go to instagram.com as well, Alex Halford. And as you can see, we have a fully customizable uh, social media lower third. So now what we're gonna do is I'm just gonna drag in a media generator a solid crawler So you guys will see that it is transparent So if I drag in the red one underneath everything as you guys clearly can see we have everything Lined up and chroma keyed. So the red is gonna be your video and as you can see we have facebook.com uh, With my link then it goes away then we have twitch then it is just slowly going to disappear and it's going to change to Twitter as you can see right here. And then also at the very end when this one is going to disappear, we have Instagram. And the only thing you need to do now is, or you can just bring back the green and you can render it out. And when you want to go ahead and put this one in a new uh, project, you can always use the green screen. Uh, or the red or the red it doesn't really matter so that's basically how simple it is guys that's it how to how to create a lower third social media now you guys know how it works so that is it for this video thank you guys for the continued support thank you guys for an over 95,000 subscribers we're only 5k away less than 5k from a hundred thousand from that silver play button so thank you for the support i'm so i'm really thankful so that is it for the video thank you guys and i'll catch you guys tomorrow for a brand new i'd ask you tutorials on thursday so i will see you guys tomorrow just Alex Halford.